Hi guys, I want to share a little tip that I learned many years ago. And it's, it's all about making sure that you allow visitors to your website to click on external links, but you don't shut the door on them. Um, so let's just give you an example of what I'm talking about. This is my website here, and I'm on a page all about fishing from a wheelchair. And, uh, and near the end of the page, not quite at the end of the page, there's a little section about where I go fishing. And there's a link to uh, a fishery over in Torquay called Rokum Retreat. Now, I've been there a few times and I really like it. So I thought I'd link to their website, you know, give them a bit of a, a, bit, of ad, ad, yeah, a bit of advertising. So, um, here's the link. So, I'll show you what happens when you click on it. You click on it, and, and we leave our website and go to their website. Let's close that a minute. I'll leave that there. So, here's their website. So, someone's been on our website, and they've seen the link, and they've clicked on it, probably before they intended to, but curiosity got the better of them. And people like clicking on links. They see a blue link. Oh, I'll click on that. And then they're, they've left my website and they're on this website. They may just carry on reading it or they may not. They may just click the back button and go back to our website. However, you know, if they start clicking around this website, then obviously they've got to click more times on, on the back link and a lot of people wouldn't bother. They just close this website and either go back to a search engine and try and find our website or they wouldn't even bother. So what we need to do is we need to make sure that we allow our visitors to explore links that we have allowed them to go to from our article, but we don't but we give them an easy opportunity to come back to our website. And it's a very simple way of doing it. So I'm going to go back. I'm going to go into Elementor, which is the an application that you can get for WordPress. That's what I use for my web website, WordPress. So we're in we're in Elementor, and we're in the administrative section on the editor. So this is what we're looking for here. There's the uh, the link that we just clicked on, and this is the editor bit where we uh, edit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on the link once like so and then we'll see here a little box comes up and click on the little pencil and then we click on the little cog wheel settings right this is what we're looking for this is the interesting bit the bit that we need to look at four boxes ignore the last three boxes it's the top one we want open link in a new tab we need to click that there like so and click update and then click update again and if you watch there once we've updated it'll change it live on the preview let's change that's what that's why i love um, elementor oh, i love that program so much i couldn't be without it anyway we'll go back down to our link here we are so remember before when we clicked it the new website opened in the same tab as ours, taking us, taking um, the, our visitor away from our website. So you watch what happens when I click it now. Let's keep an eye on our tab. So I'll click it there, like that. Right. It opens the website in a different tab, which means our website is still open in our, in our guest's browser. So even though they've gone to look at another website, they've still got the option to click there and come back to it. And that is very important. You know, it's all very well sending visitors away to look at other websites, but remember, you know, you, you know, you're not in the business to be kind to other people, especially if you're making money from your website. You know, all, you know, yeah, there's nothing wrong with letting people go to other websites, but you must make sure that they can come back easily and without any hassle. So that's an easy way 
to do it, guys. And I hope that uh, little tip helped you if you didn't already know about it. So cheers for now. Stay well and stay safe. And see you next time. Bye-bye for now.